Today, I will show you how to quickly set up your Petra wallet. Petra wallet is a self-custody wallet that allows you to explore Aptos ecosystem. If you have been in the crypto space for a while, you would be familiar with a wallet called MetaMask and Petra wallet shares some similarities with MetaMask. So let's go ahead and set up. Click download on their website. This will take you to Chrome Web Store where you can add to Chrome, add extension. And once you add the extension, as you can see, we are greeted with a Petra page where you can create a new wallet or you can import a wallet. For the purposes of this guide, we'll be creating a brand new Petra wallet. So in here, you wanna create a password that is secure. This will allow you to log into your Petra wallet on your device. So let's go ahead and create that. Um, secret recovery phrase, this is the next step. This will show us 12 words um, that you need to store safely. I would suggest writing them down somewhere. Maybe you can write down half of the words on one piece of paper and six words on another and then hide them in two different locations. This is just a suggestion, but overall you want to keep that phrase secure. Uh, you don't want to show it to anyone because with those 12 words, someone can take your funds. So here are our 12 words. This is our recovery phrase. Make sure you save it somewhere and let's go ahead and continue. Right now, you need to confirm your security phrase. That makes sure that you've actually written it down somewhere or you've saved it in a secure place. So let's go ahead and do that. So once you confirm, you'll be greeted with this page that welcomes you to the Petra wallet. And we should now have our Aptos installed. As you can see, this is our Aptos wallet. It's a very nicely laid out uh, extension wallet. On the top, you have your address that you can copy and paste it in an exchange. Uh, if you were to transfer your APT tokens to Petra, you can also buy APT using MoonPay straight from the Petra wallet. This will allow you to buy with credit card, bank transfers or Apple Pay. So as you can see, there are no assets just yet on this account. You can go to library and in library, you'll be able to see your collected NFTs. This is an NFT section. If you were to get involved in some NFTs on Aptos ecosystem, um, you can explore the NFTs available using these free websites. These are the marketplaces that have Aptos NFTs on them. You can also go to activity tab. This will show you all transactions that happen on your Petra wallet. So if you are to transact using this wallet, you would go to the activity section to check your transactions. And you can also go to settings page. The settings page allow you to change the name of your wallet. This is for your information only. As you can see, we are connected to mainnet, so let's not change anything on there. If you go to security and privacy, this will allow you to change password, auto lock your wallet, and also you'll be able to see connected apps. If you are to use Petra wallet and connect to a website, this will give you a list of websites that you're connected to. So in here, you can also lock wallet by clicking that. As you can see, our wallet is locked now. It requires a password. So if you share a laptop or your device, or maybe you're leaving the room or something, you can lock and nobody will be able to transact. However, if you input your password, this is where people will be able to make moves using your Petra wallet. Therefore, locking is always a great thing to do. You can also manage accounts. Managing account will give you a public key and a private key. Private key is um, a key that will allow you to retrieve this wallet. It's similar to the secret phrase that we've already written. So this is where you can see your private key. Let's go back. And also you can click view on Explorer. 
Uh, as you can see, this is the account that we've created. This is our wallet on Aptos and we'll be able to see all transactions directly on the Explorer right here. So this was everything you need to know when it comes to Petra wallet for Aptos ecosystem. This is it for today. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next one.